The title of the exhibition, Leaden Circles Dissolved in the Air, is a refrain from Virginia Woolf's novel, Mrs. Dalloway. The phrase refers to the chimes of Big Ben and the passing of time. As they strike, first the warning musical, then the hour irrevocable. They jolt the characters out of their daydreams and memories and remind them what they should be doing at that time of day. The pieces in this exhibition have a similar effect. They demand your attention. In the same way, the frequently repeated phrase, leaden circles dissolved in the air, connects the characters in Wolf's novel to their awareness of the passing of time. The title of this exhibition connects the works on display, tying together the diversity of artistic expression with a single strand, the phrase that connects them. Leaden circles dissolved in the air sounds rather uh, metaphorical, uh, quite abstract. We should read this uh, title as a connecting element between different generations, different attitudes, artistic point of view. We shouldn't definitely uh, decipher this title. That's a sort of visual analysis of this novel. Just, you know, it's just an inspiration point for me. I try to create an atmosphere related with political and cultural trauma. When we analyze uh, some artists' works, including Tanya Bukal, their works uh, are more engaged politically. At one angle, just they look like a monochrome minimalist painting, but actually, when you move around from left and right, then a female character appears with their guns. That struck me so much because it also symbolizes the changing role of uh, women. Like Wolf, artist Tanya Bukal places the female protagonist front and center. She then reinforces the idea of women at the center of the action by presenting women who frequently put themselves there. So it's called Those in Darkness Drop From Sight and it comes from Bertolt Brecht from Mackie Messer and I was asking myself why can't you see women fighting? Like we all know that there are a lot of women involved in armed conflicts but normally we see these women as heroes or as nurses who help um, the soldiers in bitter time and we actually don't see them ever fighting. The work is more about that, the fact that women are fighting. They all choose to do something active to change uh, their lives. I show people what I see and then, and then they can make their own decisions. I think we always have to push boundaries. As you walk around the exhibition, you can't help but gain a sense of the flow of the artist's work. One piece seems to seep into the next. There's a feeling that the exhibition very much channels Wolf's famous stream of consciousness style, where creative works aren't restrained by the rules of the real world. Kerry Alexandra, TRT World, Istanbul.